Hi my friends, today we model this part Very interesting The drawing is here and the name is Rack Guide We start by creating this uh, plate with the contour, as you can see, uh, this contour. Dimensions are 94, 30, 24, radius half of 40, 36, 36 to this uh, radius 11 and the thickness of 18 let's start new standard millimeter CPT 2d sketch this face with x to the right x to the right and we draw a circle somewhere here with the diameter of 40 then we draw lines from this point down left up again up and tangent to this circle I apply fillet of 11 to 3 corners this 3 why? because uh, dimensions are uh, using these centers Coincident is this line with the center point. This distance is 24. Thirty-six. And again thirty-six. Seventy four is this, and thirty uh, this. This uh, center of the circle is on the same vertical with the center point. Now we have a fully constrained sketch, we apply trim of this arc and we can extrude on 18, extrude 18, good. Now we apply extrude for this cylindrical uh, feature diameter 40 the total length 82 with 41 up and 82 minus 41 down let's do this we select this face for a new sketch circle with this center and this uh, dimension finish sketch extrude this but not equal distances 42 no 41 up and 82 minus 41 down 
by fortune <laughs> 82 is double of 41 then this is the mid plane for the cylinder but dimensions are dimensions yes okay another feature is this cylinder radius 25 and uh, it starts from here and ends here what is this distance 98 minus 94 divided by 2 we start from this plane we'll place here a plane and we can see that the other dimension is 22 plane at a distance of uh, 98 minus 94 divided by 2 this plane is the base for our new sketch circle with radius 24 placed at uh, a dimension of 22 from this base and on the same vertical with a center point I project this line because I want to trim uh, this arc fully constrained sketch extrude the other direction 98 okay I hide this uh, plane and you see two millimeters here two millimeters here are the distances another feature is this cylinder dimensions diameter of 22 distance of 35 from this face not this and also 22 on uh, vertical let's do this but let's see where is placed this and at 52 okay we create a plane based on xy plane at 52 a new sketch with a circle placed somewhere here radius diameter of 22 placed at a distance of 22 from the center point and 35 from this and 45 from this face to this end 35 finish sketch extrude to the part ok visibility now we have to compare this small corner with the part you see here is cylinder not any small part okay to solve the problem we select this face for a new sketch and we immediately finish the sketch then we apply extrude to this face with cut you see now all this is a cylinder another feature is uh, this uh, 
smaller diameter from this face down. What is the dimension? The dimension is 36, diameter of 36 instead of 40. We select this face, we draw a circle of 36, finish sketch, and we extrude this area with cut to this face. You see? Okay, good. Now the holes. This is 32. This hole. This is 26. This hole. Here is 10. This. And the three counter boards with definition here 18, 4, and 8. Let's start with the major one hole face center 32 is already placed here through all plus this face this center 26 again through all plus this face this center 10 millimeters diame diameter and to this internal face. Okay, let's verify. Okay, yes. Now I select this face. I also project the other two to have these points. More than this, I place this kind of points and two solutions. This is one and the other is I eliminate this. To select these two points with the keeping press the shift key on the keyboard and selecting this solution yes the same situation what is the advantage the advantage is that we don't need to select anything in order to have placed that three holes hole you see already appears something I select counterbore I place here diameter of 15 this is 4 millimeters this is 8 and through not 2 okay you see good very nice now you see undimensioned fillets are radius 1. This is dimensioned and this, but there are many not uh, dimensioned. There are a lot. All these around. I take a look uh, in order to uh, see all of them. I suppose the radius is 1. Yes, I select this, I change to 1, and I start placing. that uh, here is also one I continue with this this 
the other one and I hope that everyone is okay okay let's see what about the chamfers chamfers are 1 at 45 where are chamfers only here yes I don't see any other one good this chamfer of one okay let's see what is the volume my friends I properties physical update copy close double click here and we place the new dimension the new dimension is the original dimension so I cancel because I don't change uh, identical dimensions then we apply view no shaded and material still cast general aspect also still cast and uh, we select some faces for applying uh, still polished you can select any face you want I also place here I keep press the shift key on the keyboard and I apply still polished if I change the light to default lights we can compare the two but must be in the same position you see I forgot this let me apply here also still polished yes now if all are covered or not this is the part that's all for today thanks for watching bye bye